Samantha. Hello everyone, Samantha here. I pray all is well with you. In this video, I'm doing a reflection page in my December journal. I have not been keeping up with it like I intended to. Um, it's just been um, busy and this weekend it did um, slow down a bit. And so, um, yeah, so I had left off with day six. I'm going to go. I have an idea for day seven. Um, yeah. And so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Um, I have wrote down gifts. Um, on this reflection page. But... I have an idea for the decoration, but it's weird. I don't want to, like, write anything. I don't know what that's about. And it's very simple what I want to try. It's just like I just want to decorate the page. And so guess what? That's what I'm going to do. Just decorate the page. Um, And I'll probably come back later at some point and decorate it. But you know what? One thing I really learned about journaling um, and stuff is that it's your journaling. So whatever you want to do, do. I think when you know, I, I watch other videos and this is not to like, like, um, say something is wrong with, you know, how people do things. I just, you just have to learn what's for you. Um, I see people get bogged down with how they do things when they're making content because the subscribers may not like it. Oh, that's not what their subscribers want to see. And I think, you know, that has its place because some people, they do this for a living. And they actually, it's not a hobby. It's more of a job. Like, like if they were teaching somewhere. Um, not that I don't care about my subscribers because I do. Um, and those that view the channel, I'm so grateful for them, God knows. But... I realize more and more, this is more of like a hobby for me. This is an outlet. It's real therapeutic for me. And I like to share ideas and post the videos. And then I'll go back and look at them sometimes. I didn't always do that. I used to feel weirded out. Um, but I say all that to say that um, for me, since it's my journaling and um, I don't get like... Like, oh my God, I have to fill the white space. Or, oh my God, it got to look like this. It got to look like that. Because um, some a subscriber said that they didn't like something. Um, if it was a job and that's why I was doing it and it was for that purpose, then maybe. And again, I say it's not that I don't care what my subscribers think or feel. That's, that would be cold. It's just that my purpose is different on YouTube. And... You know, um, I don't have, I don't have like a large following and, you know, different things that, you know, um, content creators that are doing this for a job and they need to consider that, I guess, really. Um, and then again, I've, I've watched some channels where they, they, they don't drive themselves crazy with that at all. <laughs> So, if I don't feel like writing on my journal page or whatever, I'm not going to force it because I think somebody's going to look at it and say, like, why she didn't write something or that? No, because that's not my purpose. Um, I share my process. And it's so funny, like, I know that, but just having a conversation with my husband, like, about something, like, really clarified that for me, like... Yeah, you know what? This is like me just sharing my journey. It's pretty therapeutic. And 
I don't need to be um like bogged down with all the other stuff. You know, um you know. I don't need I don't need to to um be bothered with that. And if this channel was to grow to like like in that kind of way, I still would not um change how I do things because um that that's not that's not for me unless the Lord had me do that for some reason but it's just sharing authentically what I'm doing um I have other responsibilities where I have to meet deadlines and do things that people say do I can't put no more of that on myself like that's not gonna work for me I'm gonna have to put some um glue on this because it's not working too well, as you can see. Yeah, I have already responsibilities where, you know, there's deadlines, gotta do, and I have to do some things that I don't like to do. And when it comes to creative expression, I couldn't bear the thought of not being able to express myself honestly and authentically because I have to make content that somebody else want, likes i just and then i don't and, and and then i don't like that oh no oh i'm just it's just it's a it's forcing nah no thank you <laughs> no thank you um and again there's nothing wrong with it that's just some people can some people like that they throw off that that's not for me you got to know what's for you to you and so I was like you know what I ain't do I couldn't because that was the other thing too other things was happening and I couldn't keep up I was like my intent was to do one every day you know because I see people doing vlogmas and stuff like that and I sort of kind of wanted to like do my reflection piece every day in that journal but I couldn't <laughs> And now that I turned in all my homework assignments, I still don't want to put that pressure on myself. Um, so if if I do it, I do it. If I don't, I don't. And I'm at peace. You know, those are certain boundaries I put for myself, especially with a YouTube channel. You better have some boundaries because if not, I hear some 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 stuff boy I, I watch videos and listen to you know some things people share and um it's like yep you better have boundaries you better have boundaries because if you don't somebody will set them for you and you will be helter skelter so i thank god for the gift of peace and I think in me sharing, that's what I'm going to put here. And I thank God for those that, you know, do watch my videos. I appreciate, you know, who is here and who watches it, you know. Because I will not say, oh, because I don't have, like... A whole bunch of views that I don't have nobody watching my channel. That's disrespectful. Because the people that do watch it, they are not chop liver. They are somebody. And that counts. They count. They matter. And so, you know... You want to start a channel, or you started a channel, you feel like because you don't have like that many people watching it, but you you start did you start it for a lot of people to watch it, or did you start it because you wanted to make videos? And that's something everybody have to look in their own heart and see, you know. And one thing I could really, really say is this is really therapeutic for me even trying to cut this little piece out here something about that kind of anal yep 
but I like it. <laughs> ain't hurt nobody. Paper ain't saying ouch. Okay, so you know how you have a present and it looks like a little box. So what I'm gonna do is make a little bow. Can I make a little bow with this? Let me see. I think I probably can. There's two colors here. Oh, and I put two colors down. Look at that. I ain't even mean to do that, but that's a okay. Let's see. I think I can make a little bow. Let's see. That's one. That's why it was sticking different. This one has a better stick than that one. So that's what was going on there. I'm like, why was it sticking before and now all of a sudden? That's what I was thinking. I didn't say it, but that's what I was thinking. Lo and behold. So this one doesn't have a great adhesion on the back. Let's see. I'm making a little bow, y'all. Oh, I think I did it. I think I did it, y'all. <laughs> and no, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it down. It's probably going to end up like, I know it's going to be smashed down a bit. This off of here. <laughs> I'm gonna cut off a little piece of so yeah. And I like the the whole idea of not having to like be how can I say or it's just it's just a lot of stuff that come with different ways you do things and they're not necessarily bad you just got to know your temperament and what works for you and not try to be like everybody else because the moment you try to be like everybody else and it's not or a trend or something and it's not you it's not gonna work god is not gonna let it work and even if you do do it but if you don't have no peace then what's the use like with the craziness i mean there's things that like i said i know that i need to do in life that i would not prefer with certain things but that's a part of life you gotta do what you gotta do but there's some things, it's just like, you know what? I do not need to do that. God has given me peace. And I do not need to overwhelm myself with the unnecessary. You know? Oh, let me move it up some. Okay, that's better. And put this here. Put that down. There we go. Alrighty. I like that. Uh, okay. And I'm going to write something with my, my new pen here. These beautiful pens that I got from the Dollar Tree. I got a video coming out about them. All right. Um, so, I'm thinking, should I color my quadrants here? I'm thinking, should I color them? I do want to put a small piece of tape, I think. Just a tiny sliver of tape. I'm trying to think, should I cover, should I color these quadrants? Or should I just leave well enough alone with it? I think I'm going to put like some kind of gem or something there, y'all. 
I think that would be cute. I think a green one. Or maybe even this blue would be cute. But let me stick with a more traditional Christmas color. But white blue could be for, you know, the winter light. Walking in the winter wonderland. I got gems that I could put. You know what? That's what I want to put, y'all. Put the gems. Some blingy blingy, some blingy blingy stuff over here, or do I? Here's this bling stuff. Okay, y'all. I may have to. Where I put it? Oh God, I don't want to have to it. See? Now I know better than to put that thing up so far. Oh. Man. Oh. I do not want to pause this video. Well, I can't. I don't know how to pause the video on the um on my um phone. I don't know how to do that. I don't know how to pause it. I'll stop it, and then I'm gonna have to do um a second video. I'm gonna have to merge it, and I I don't want to merge it. Okay, one second. I'm gonna hear a bag over here because I got some things. Okay. He's packing up. Well, wrapping. Let me get these stickers. Okay. One minute. Christmas shopping, but I just thank God for like the bargains and stuff that I got that I didn't go crazy, I didn't go broke, um, and then I was able to, you know, do some things in moderation, get some things. Okay, so I think I'm going to put a little bit of a bling here. See these gems? Like this. I like that. Ooh. One good way. Let me slow down a bit. Because that's why the stuff is falling. I'm moving a bit too fast. Let me move it. Put it here. Um, I wouldn't say I was rambling, but honestly, like, I'm like, I wonder what all the. I know I had a point of what I was saying. <laughs> oh Lord Jesus, thank you. All right, and so, um. That goes like this. So I'm gonna go ahead and put I'ma write thanks Lord for the gift of peace. Mm -hmm. Thanks Lord for the gift of your presence and thanks Lord for the gift of boundaries thanks Lord for the gift of your guidance. Yeah. And that is my card for December. And I love it. I truly, truly love it, y'all. I truly love it. 
And this I could always glue down even a little more. Oh, but it's still sticky. Let me just press it down. And if need be, I can always come back in and glue it down some more if necessary. Let me see how I can get it in here. Let's see. I think I'm going to do another page. <laughs> I love it. I love it. It's so simple, but then I just love it. So it's nice. It's I know that I was going to write those in the quadrants. I just kept seeing a little, like, this, um, like a little present, like. So that's it for this video. With that being said, thanks for watching. God bless you. And remember, Jesus loves you. He's the greatest gift of all. Salvation, y'all. Alrighty. Jesus is the reason for the season.